here. It is Wednesday, April 27th, 2011. Um, had another uh, interesting and long day today. I, I attended the third day of, of the, of the uh, career exploration workshop and it was pretty interesting. I Today we, um, we discussed uh, um, resumes and applications um, we saw a few lectures on, on, um, on screen about, you know, you know, how people, uh, how, what, what questions to ask and, and what not to ask. And it was, uh, very interesting today. And then, uh, we had a third, um, third um, achievement story and I chose um, when I was working at Burrell's at the beginning I was like I was basically um, um, oops, sorry excuse me um, 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 <laughs> uh, at first I was like this type of guy like oh, I just want to do what I was you know what the job description was and you know and and then later on I decided well I can't I, that's not a way to, to do work I mean so I made a conscious decision to to um, do other tasks other than what was in the job description so and whenever the supervisor asked me if I wanted to do something and I said Sure, we're gonna do it, and I did it. And what? Some of those tasks were um, uh, sorting and filing newspapers, um, um, labeling envelopes, gluing, um, gluing uh, tabs to newspaper clips, and you know. And I, I told, I told them, um, hey, if if the super if if the supervisor told me to go clean the bathroom, hey, I'd go clean the bathroom. But you know, of course, they probably had like janitors to do that kind of stuff. It's probably like places like McDonald's or or Tim Hortons or any food uh, fast food restaurant. You'd probably be asked to do that. They probably weren't won't, wouldn't be like any any like janitorial position for that so yeah so but like I said I'd, I'd be willing to do anything you know and I think that's I mean that's part of the reason why I lasted so long at Burrell's because of that mentality I mean that you know will you do anything asked mentality Hi. so Chris here again um This week, I've been trying to improve myself, um, improve things that I need to be improved. Um, um, do more housework. Um, it's a lot neater, you know. You know. I mean, I mean, you've may notice like in some videos. Um, 
there's been a, there's been a mess on the floor, or clothes on the floor, dishes, um, a lot of dishes in the sink. Um, so, yeah, um, I I don't know if I mentioned this before. Um, yeah, I think I have about the dishes. Yeah, and about you know. Who does the dishes in the morning? Who does the dishes at night? And alternate in, in the um, in the afternoon dishes, the lunch dishes. Um, and it's actually um, uh, so far this week <laughs> we've actually you know managed to you know uh, keep the dishes under control. I mean, but. They're actually, I mean, this is, these are the night dishes, and, um, so, I mean, I do those, by the way, <laughs> later on, I mean, um, I'm just letting them soak at the moment. Um, another, th um, another thing I need to improve on, um, of course, watching less TV. I mean, I, I've, I've found myself, I mean, since I've been unemployed, I, I've been watching um, uh, way too much TV. Because, um, well, of course, being unemployed, um, I got a lot of time in my hands. Of course, I've been, you know, job searching. Uh, Two. Um, so, and I think it's important to decrease my TV time, too, because, you know, because of my daughter, I mean, I, I mean, I, we've set TV limits for her, you know. She only watch two hours TV in the morning and two hours TV after school. Um, most of the time she has to play. Uh, of course, she gets lots to play at school, so that's good. Um, so, I mean, I'd be, I, I mean, I mean, I feel like a hypocrite sometimes. I mean. Here I'm telling my old, I'm telling my daughter, well, you gotta watch less TV, more play, more creative um, things that you should do, like draw, paint, play, to you know, to boost the imagination. You know, it's I think it's important for a child to have a good, healthy imagination. I mean, I mean, as a kid, I had I had a a wonderful imagination. I mean, I mean, as a kid, I don't think I really ever watched a lot of TV. I was either, I don't know, outside, riding my bike, playing with my friends, you know, reading, writing, developing my creativity, my imagination. I mean, it wasn't a day that went by that I wasn't either reading a book or writing a story. I mean, yeah, so I think it's important that I think I want to get back into that, you know. I want to read more. I want to maybe, I don't know, pick up writing again. Pick, I mean, you know, pick up, yeah, pick up writing, you know, write more. I mean, write stories again. Instead of you know, sitting in 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 front of the television all day. I mean, that's not good. Because because you know, sitting in the front of a a TV screen or a computer screen all day. It, 
it affects your imagination, you know? You, I mean, the more, I mean, the less things you do creative, creatively, creatively, um, the less your imagination goes away. I mean, the less imaginative you are. I think I want to, you know, I admit, I mean, some, I, um, I'm not as creative as I used to be. And I think I want to change that, you know? Actually, I think I'll want to get back into this book I've been reading. Actually, this uh, level six decorations. I mean, I started reading it. I'm like, oh well, of course, I think I'm halfway through it now. I, I guess you know, I, uh, you know, I love to finish it. I, I'll probably will finish it. Probably one of my goals to finish that book. It seems a really interesting book. I mean, because. Um, It, um, I'd love to finish it. I, I'll probably will finish it. Probably one of my goals is to finish that book. It seems a really interesting book. I mean, because um, it um, to read about it. Read. I mean, they say it's always. I mean. When you have, when you have a, like a book or a movie, you know, the the book is always much so much better because um, because you don't have the picture of um, you don't have any external pictures there. You have it's all in your head, you know. It, I mean, reading about it. Um, I don't know, it just sparks your creativity, you know? I mean, you're thinking about it. You're, you're, you're imagining in your head the story that, that you read, you know? I mean, it's like a movie in your head. And that's, that's why they say, um, you know, the book is always much, so much better than, 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 than the, um, the movie. Um. And plus, I want to practice what I preach. I mean, in terms of my daughter, I mean, I mean, I teach her. I mean, I've been we've been teaching her that that you should watch less TV and and play more. And you know, I think I should you know to make sure that six in my daughter's head. I mean, I should you know. Do it too. I mean, I should, you know, limit my TV and do more creative things. I mean, um, yeah. So, so this week has been about improving myself. I'm always, I'm oh, I always want to improve myself. I mean. I've been doing it for a long time. Um, in some places I improved myself already. I've um, I've noticed my self uh, esteem has been better, and in taking one of those work uh, acti workshop activities at the career exploration workshop, I've noticed you know my self esteem has. Uh, improve greatly. I mean, I'm, I'm less afraid to do things. I mean, in terms of, like driving, um, living on my own. I mean, that was, I mean, when I was young, I was like, that was one of my uh, low self-esteem points there. I mean, I was, 
I mean, I was afraid to live on my live in, in, independently because um, cause, I don't know, I was just, I don't know, afraid of being homesick, you know, lonely. Um, but, you know, but about 20, when I was 26, you know, I met my wife. Um, and, and I moved down to my parents' place, and, you know, and for the past eight, nine years, I mean, I've been, you know, doing great in that department, I mean, living, living in, in, independently, um, and not being afraid of it, you know, of course, you know, having a wife and and two kids, you know, I'm not really living alone, you know, so, so I'm not so lonely, you know, um, so yeah, I mean, I mean, doing this workshop has, you know, taught me to improve myself, be a better, I don't know, person, <laughs> as you will. Um, yeah, I, th I've uh, talked long enough, um, I hope I've been recording this all, and yes I have, <laughs> sweet, <laughs> I'd hate to, <laughs> I hate it when, you know, um, you, you talk a lot, and then, and then you, then you find out, like, you know, you made a mistake and you're not recording, like, you have to do it again. Oh, jeez, I hate when I do that, but, you know. Because, <laughs> you know, um, because, you know, uh, I, uh, hate <laughs> redoing things, you know. I mean, so, with that being said, um, I guess that's about it for today. So, see you tomorrow. Hopefully, um, tomorrow I'll, you know, get back to my regular type of vlogs. You know, playing with my kids. I mean, so, see you tomorrow. Bye.